Storm Shield weather, certified most accurate. Good Saturday evening, everyone. I'm Storm Shield meteorologist Brandon William, and take a look at the picture today from Keith Davis. This is the sunrise at Ulaga Lake, a beautiful sight there. You can always send us your weather pictures at weatherpix at kjrh.com. On live Storm Shield radar right now, all is quiet except for to the northwest of Enid, a severe thunderstorm warning there. But for us, it does look quiet for the overnight period. Maybe over the next couple of hours, right before sunset, we could find a few isolated showers and thunderstorms left in the forecast. 91 degrees is your current temperature, 72 degrees for that dew point. Southerly winds now up to around 10 miles per hour. And those current temperatures into the 80s to the lower 90s. We have Vanita now at 89 degrees, Bartlesville at 90, and into the mid 80s around Okima, 84 degrees to be exact in McAllister. Now when we factor in the relative humidity, that gives us the heat index. So unfortunately now in Bartlesville, what it really feels like to our bodies now at 103 degrees here for the six o'clock hour. Those winds now between about five and 15 miles per hour, of course, stronger out near that severe thunderstorm warning post by the National Weather Service. Today in Tulsa, we've seen those gusts up to around 25 miles per hour. The official daytime high today at 91 degrees, a bit below the average for this time of year of 93. But we do actually have warmer high temperatures on the way for next week on your latest seven day forecast and just a trace of rain today at the Tulsa International Airport. On the radar and satellite, the main energy continues to dive to the south, now located in throughout northern Texas as it continues to exit the state. But again, a few showers and some isolated thunderstorms left over the next couple of hours. Timing things out on future track clouds and precipitation for the overnight period. It does look dry with partly cloudy to mostly clear skies. Then for tomorrow on your Sunday, I think a lot of sunshine, mostly sunny skies for the morning, at least for the early morning. And then by the afternoon, building up the clouds and a slight chance for showers and some isolated thunderstorms, but less of a chance tomorrow. So that looks great if you do have recreational plans. The chance only rated at about 20% and it definitely looks dry for tomorrow evening. Overnight lows tonight once again dropping off into the 70s, including Pahuska at 72 degrees sky took at 73 southeasterly winds between about 5 and 10 miles per hour. Partly cloudy to mostly clear skies. It does look dry overnight tonight. Okmulgee at 73, 71 for our viewers in Tahlequah and a dry forecast tonight. You fall it down to about 73 degrees. McAllister at 74. The winds all less than about 10 miles per hour. Let's help plan your day for tomorrow on your Sunday. Again, sunshine for the morning at 8 o'clock at 77 degrees by 5 o'clock 93 that's the expected daytime high in Tulsa and a 20% chance for showers and some isolated thunderstorms. Daytime highs from the low to the mid 90s, including Talala at 93 degrees, southerly winds between about 10 and 15. High temperatures once again into the 90s. We have Tahlequah at 91 degrees. Unfortunately, it does get hotter for next week on your seven day forecast. Eufaula at 93, southerly winds between about 5 and 10. Slight chance for showers and storms by tomorrow afternoon. It does look dry though on Monday, mostly sunny and 95 degrees, but I must say pretty breezy for next week. Look at Tuesday, southerly sustained between about 15 and 25. Another chance for showers and storms for Wednesday and also for Friday and Saturday.